okay, so instead of just having a single line to lift up the, let's say, 100 pound load, what are you gonna do? We're gonna take our pulley, which is, remember the shiv and the housing all together. We're gonna and take a hook for the load. And you, need a, you need a pulley that has an eye on the end of it. You see that? Yep, just okay. like that. So, we'll slip this around. This is what's gonna be holding up our load. So it'll be facing like this. Okay. So let's come over here. What we want to do is to make sure that the line runs under the wheel. Because if you slip it through the top, you can see how it's not going through the wheel whatsoever. Too much friction. The whole point of the wheel is to cut down on friction. Good. So we slip it through the bottom. And you can see how that will slip around the wheel. Okay, then what do you do? Uh, now... Got to make some kind of loop. Now we take a bit more line. Okay, hold on, let me get... Uh, good. Make a loop. Give yourself enough room. You don't need to worry about it. Wrap it around fing two fingers, one finger, whatever you need. Make a loop like that. And then slip it under the line you just have. And pull it through. There's your loop. Just like that. Make sure it's tight. Works perfectly. You can see it's around that. Okay. Slow down. Okay. So, now we take our S hook. We put it along the same bolt we use for the saddle. Or the sling, sorry. Okay. Right like that. Now we take our line and the loop we just made and put it on that S hook and make sure everything's set up correctly down here that the line is going along the pulley wheel or the shiv. Right. Just like that. So hang the, uh, the duct tape for, for now. Yep. There so we go. now we have what's called two parts of line. So uh, we got two, two parts of line. One part is attached to that S hook which is hanging on the bolt. It's anchored. So basically it's connected to the, so the boom is holding up half the load. Correct. So if this, if we had a hundred pound load, 50 pounds is being held up by the boom, and the other 50 pounds is there. Yep. So Eight. you've got a mechanical advantage of? Two. So just by adding that pulley, we've cut the, the, the effort needed in half. The only trade-off is now I have to pull this line twice as far to raise the duct tape the same distance. Well, there is no free lunch. No sorry. free lunch. Okay. But it is much easier. Yeah, even with friction, it's much easier. Okay, so that's called two parts of line. And uh, okay, now let's hang that instead of the duct tape, hang that five-pound nut. Very easy to lift. Okay. Great. Okay. Twenty pound, cra uh, twenty dollar crane. Go out and put it together. <laughs>